Hello everyone, welcome for this second video in this series. If you haven't watched the first episode, I suggest you go and watch it. It's here, somewhere. So that you know exactly what we started with and how we got here. So you can follow the whole series properly. Also, the same rule still applies in this episode. So I will leave you with the part where I explain all the rules from the first episode and I will use that before every video. But before I leave you with that, I just want to remind you that everything has been recorded live. The link is in the description and the name is on the screen. You can find me there every Saturday 11 a.m. CT. But also at the moment I'm trying to stream a bit more often. So I'll tend to stream during weekdays at like 9 p.m. on Tuesday, Wednesday. So you can find me there and maybe enjoy some content with me. I'm not only doing music, I'm also playing some games. I'm, I plan to play some games with the community. So come and join us and maybe we'll have fun together. Anyway, I will not hold you any longer. Enjoy this episode and I'll see you next week for the next one. Bye. We'll see the whole process from start to finish. So what do I call uh, start and what do I call finish? Start is however I start a track as if it was a track for Aria. And what I call finish is the final project, something I would just export send for mastering and ask for release. I will not use any paid VST except for Sarah. While the final product shouldn't have any paid VST, I'm allowed to use anything I want during the whole process. I can use my usual effects, my usual VST and stuff, but I will, I will have to replace all that with free version or Sarah. And I forgot to start re the recording, of course. So uh, yeah, quick, uh, quick heads up for YouTube. Uh, I'll give a listen back to the track and I do not like it much anymore. So we changed the bass sample and we're just recreating the piano piece that is on the sample and we'll see what we come, can come to based on this. The last one is different. Four, five, six, and seven. Kind of hard to get this one right.
what 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 am I hearing? Here, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of this, but it's missing one. I think that's it. This one sounds weird. Hello, uh, I'm Jet05, welcome to the stream. Uh, so I think it's pretty much it. Let's go back.
I'm singing amazing music on Great Tournament and Winner. I just followed you because I like producer streams on Twitch because they can have so many choices with producers today. Love with uh, nice. Um, <laughs> to sound like something. Just saying that the last chord is still not correct, so I'll try to fix it. For some reason, my brain cannot process this one. Uh, oops, this can go here. This. Yes, I think we're good. I think we're good, but it's missing, you know, the kind of natural sounding piano uh, chords uh, and strumming. This one was nice. 
let's go back here and try to replace these chords with something more like this whoops Try to move these things around a bit. Something a bit more natural and less robotic, which is nice. And I will maybe just slightly add some uh, randomizer here. Not with the panning. The panning should stay as is, but more like this. Something with a velocity, just to add a bit more variation. Not too much, because uh, I don't want anything to stand out too much and other stuff to be like completely flat, but something like this. Oh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Forgot to remove one thing. There, the pitch should be at zero, of course. And uh, velocity should be like this. There we go. Can maybe push it a bit further. Reset the velocity of all that to there and move back down and start again. Kind of have everything like this. Okay, so just a small tip if you want some more natural sounding piano, just uh, like move around the start time of uh, the different notes and the end time to like not have everything like right on the grid all the time because uh, when you play the piano it's very more likely not gonna happen that you hit everything at once perfectly synchronized and stuff you'll most likely have a small Can I have some that hits perfectly at the same time, but it's not like all of them. So just moving around slightly the, end, uh, the start time and end time of all these. 
kind of helps and also change the velocity because not every node will be hit with exactly the same power. That's basically what the velocity means here. So we have the base uh, chords and stuff and there was also a second melody here. Okay, so let's uh, make it unique. Exactly. I know it should be something like this, like you know, when you just hit a couple of notes on the way. Hey, hey, harsh indeed, it's been a while. <laughs> Great to see you again. How you been doing? Sounds okay. Doing good lately. Yeah, I'm doing good. Doing good. Let me drink something. Just thinking. No, we'll keep it as is. Or. We'll try something, we'll try something uh, with that melody.
Okay, let's see with a base under it, make unique that thing. Oops, 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 oops. And oops, quick legato. Boom. Check the other brace, like the rolling one. This one. I think it would be even better, even better to have it Oops. chop, 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 like this. Uh, no, sorry. Chop, but like uh, chop, 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 like this. Okay. Oh shit! Gonna do it like this, so I'll have to manually do this that this one like this this one like this all this like that because it's kind of you know jazzy and stuff so it's nice to have it rolling but more like whoops like this course it was gonna happen that I have to adjust some stuff here this one can get moved this can get removed this can get down this can get up down up Just remove all that because it's basically the same chord progression as here, the same bass line, except that the one that are here are supposed to be these. Let's see if I can maybe use a different bass than this one to have like less uh, grain on it. Uh, since we're rolling, might be. This one will work. This one will work definitely.
and maybe spread the voices a bit more. And I would be tempted because it's jazzy and stuff to go for triplets instead of like a uh, normal grid, but I'm not sure. I'll, I'll try both, I think. Uh, so maybe what I'll do is here, make this one unique. And if you do not know the trick, claw machine. And I'm on a uh, three, four. And normally now it should be automatically set in triplets. It adds something. Ah, should I go with that? I don't know. I don't know. I cannot decide. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, make unique, make unique, make unique. Oops, here, claw machine to... Ah, no, not this. Claw machine. And th this is where it will really come to life. Like... Both works, actually, both works. For triplets, I think. Uh, yeah, I think I'll go for triplets. I like triplets when it comes to jazzy stuff, so... I'll go for triplets. That will be it. Let's see. Uh, now we need some other sounds to go around this. Um, what kind of... Uh, What kind of sound could I use? Uh, first, I'm gonna pick up the... Uh... So you've chosen triplets. Uh, let me uh, quickly... Quickly set up stuff. Uh, this... Ooh, I already have some ideas for the ARP rhythm and I just don't know what kind of pads or synths we could use for that. That's the only thing I do not know much. I'm thinking maybe... Uh, let me check if I still have... Did I tell you that uh, one of my hard drives died and that I lost a lot of my presets. <laughs> I had a lot more. Flying fuck. <laughs> Dead. 
this could be used. I'll put some formant on that and it will really work well with uh, the rest of the track, definitely. But I was more looking for pads and stuff. Uh, this one. Hmm, well. That's the part where I cry because I lost some really nice presets for that. Let's take a minute to cry about that. Um. Could maybe check here. This could work. This could work, but uh, we need to get everything laid out properly. I'm stupid. I uh, didn't put the right grid on, so I have to start all this again because uh, you know oops, this is supposed to be like this. Da, 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 da. I think it might be a bit too much. Might be a bit too much. Something I do not know yet, and that I will look it up. I will look up. Sorry, right now is uh, where is scalar? It's here. Let's see. What's what's the progression here?
C minor. Seems like a C minor scale or the F major Dorian. Oh, it's an F minor. Mm, let's see, let's see, let's see. F minor could be could be F minor. I think maybe this one I can replace it uh, not with this but with one of the keys the keyboard here
the melody will write itself like so easily. So easily, trust me. Oh, come on, I, I really want to put it in, so I'll, I'll do so. Let's grab all that. Let's go here. Let's put that thing on the chords. Let's uh, remove these. Uh, let's just keep the chords themselves. Ah, fuck, yeah, that will be a problem, I think. Uh, let's quickly get to that thing. And I'll try to fix that problem in a minute. Uh, chop. This. Uh, that's where, oh, come on. Building that thing up quite a few times today already. This, and now all this is the easy ones. Boom, boom, boom. This one like this. I have to do and I don't know why I'm like trying to redo all that all this all these and all these as a base just no just as a solder to sound. Okay.
Ah, hello, Reignite. Welcome to the stream and thanks, Bitfighters, for the sub. Uh, and welcome to the stream. Finally, a Saturday where I'm off. Nice. Nice, nice. Uh, let me quickly check. Uh, okay. Still good on time. Let's see. There is one press it there that is not supposed to be there. Ah, let's see. Is there any of these ones that could actually work? Ah. I think it's okay like this, but now I have to uh, make the chords and that's a little bit of a funny part. Maybe I can, no, first I will improve the melody a bit more and then I'll go on for the, uh, the chord melody and then it'll be good. Uh, welcome to the club. Uh, but they're just really annoying to stay home while it's sunny outside. 
have a garden, you can go outside. <laughs> Just teasing.
ways, but I still mono legato. That's what's missing. What's missing here? Mono legato, like this. I was like, why is it not gliding? Because we did not set up that thing properly. Just thinking maybe I should go for a really basic one but um oh, wait actually where is it seem in it this one Something like this, but then uh ta -dum -tum -tum. something like this and probably on the uh, fine and on the fine here too matrix go by directional and something like this I guess Still something not right.
this one. I'll try to soften up a little bit. Hello, Nutsy. Welcome to the stream. I'm doing fine. What about you? Okay, now let's start with the chords
So you know the drill by now if you follow all the stream. If not, Scalar will be my friend for the next couple of minutes. And uh, hold on, because it will be quite long and annoying for you, I guess. Okay, I'm very glad to hear I'm going out on barbecue soon in the sun. Good summer vibe. Yes, been missing that. It's really nice. It's been missing the sun quite a lot. I don't know where you live, not see, but here it was like so gray for the last something like six months or something. Like, whew. come on, some sun, finally. So I'll probably spend a bit part of the day outside, as I said, working on finishing these acoustic panels. Yeah, it'll be nice. Let me detach this one. So that I can like have it on the other screen. And I need a D sharp. And it's probably a seventh. So G sharp C. Nani The fuck? What did I do? So it's the same as this one, but an octave higher. Or maybe I should already use the G major, but how can I get this one? G, 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 G. It's a G minor here, and I need a G major here. Uh, GBD, BD, 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 BD. And I need a C. Is there a better option for that? It's an 11th. here GBC is not an option yeah So sevens, B, D, e, F. And here it's a C. I can go back here and look for the C. <laughs> Let me quickly look at that. Ah, do you watch Hentai? No. <laughs> Why that question? <laughs> Out of nowhere? Because I say nanny? Nanny? Uh, 
No, I like anime in general. <laughs> I'm not sure I want to listen to that on stream though. <laughs> I can send it. Uh, I will give it a listen, but probably not on stream because you know I still kind of uh, want to keep that thing up. Uh, uh, wait. Uh, so I'm on the C and I need a D sharp. So it will be probably here G C. Probably a seventh. Yes, so G, uh, D cross. Cross a seven. So G A cross. Ah, this one. G A cross D. C C C C C C C did an F so G C F uh, this one is the next core which is uh, gonna be the D sharp.
Uh, let's limit that thing. Uh, yeah, accept. Let's this. Let's fill the harmonies in. Tup, 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 tup. Tup, tup. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one. This, 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 and this. There's one thing missing. Fuck. What? Already copy all that. Was too lazy to start selecting all that again. And here I'll correct what's missing so this is this thing okay and i need this one for D. Hello, did we change the melody? Yes, uh, we started again from scratch because I didn't like the previous uh, thing we started last week. So I started something new from a different sample and stuff.
That will work. That will work. That will work. Let's this. You need this one to go fetch a G. I'm not sure the kick will fit. We'll see. one I think so yeah okay and this one is a C again
gonna release this track. No, it's not gonna re be released. It's gonna be given away for free as an FLP for the people that will join on a very specific day. I will give all the info on Discord and stuff. And if not, it will be available for a couple of uh, bucks on Gumroad if you cannot make it on the stream. I will put something here. I do not know what yet, but I will put something there just to cover, uh, like, pl play the melody with something kind of dry. So let me maybe just already do that. Uh, let's add a new synth. Put that regard out yourself. Uh, we have enough stuff, don't worry.
Well, some small stuff I will fix. Let me open a new MFL studio and I will uh, go fix the attack because if you remember, uh, we used the uh, punch tutorial we made like a year ago and uh, picked the right tonal for this thingy. Let me quickly look up what version is used here? Aria Punch Tutorial. Let me grab that one. Um, Aria Punch Tutorial. You will not hear whatever is going on in this FL Studio, but I will just quickly uh, set up the right tunnel for this attack. That's the one. Okay, and um, let me replace that thing. Should sound better. an idea but I don't know how I will make it I think I know but let's see let's see how it sounds let me pick one of the re space Let me quickly set things up a bit better and I think I will go I have to think of something right now. Uh, oh, you know what? I'll, I'll go just 
so that people do not have to download 20,000 different VST. Let's just go with that option, create an automation clip like this. Just to make sure, I will put a fruity scent behind that and play with the dry, just to make sure that everything is completely dry here and it's not like coming back. Because there is a bit of release on that thing. Actually, let's do it even better. Uh, type in value 0 0.5, something like this here. Uh, something like this more. Oof, uh, how do I do that? 50%. Uh, da, 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 da. So 12, uh, one, six. Oh, okay, let me grab the calculator. So I have 50% divided by six, eight. Okay, uh, 58. Maybe this.
Okay, I think we have a good base, so let's listen to everything again, and I think it will finish that thing for today. has a nicer vibe than the previous one yes agreed this one is actually making me want to work on it so yeah guess that was a good call to start again from something new because the point is to finish that thing so uh, so let me already spoil some stuff I will do in this one probably gonna change a bit the end of the melody here uh, just to give a, a different feeling and a feeling of like uh, conclusion in that melody. And I will also probably use some kind of, you know, uh, soul vocal with some distortion and chop them and stuff to have some kind of uh, nice vibe going on with a nice vocal. Maybe I could quickly do that I don't know uh, let's see please I'm not missing you light it up light it up Uh, let's in slice X. Light it. Da. Da -da. We add a new region. Uh, think something like this. Uh, light, light it, light it up, light it up. 
might have to like fix the uh might have to fix the pitch that's definitely something i will have to do but let's quickly grab some effects to put on this thing mixer big vocals no singing vocals maybe and activate the distortion on it don't worry it loads a lot of like vst that i will replace in the end Uh, what am I looking for? Fastest. Boom. Let me grab that thing and put it here. Light it up. Light it. Spoiler alert, it will not sound good. I'm sorry for that, but I will have to find the right pitch for that thing. So I will have to play it in the track to see what it sounds like. So what's going on? Light it up. 
Okay, that's the basic for next stream. I will probably fix this vocal properly next stream. But yeah.